how to root Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro so hello and welcome guys welcome to crack straight YouTube channel and today in this video I'm gonna show you how can you root your Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro so without wasting time let's get started as you can see here this is Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro and in this video I'm going to show you how to root this Redmi Note 7 Pro and before proceeding to the video make sure guys you subscribe to our crack straight YouTube channel and hit that notification bell as well so to root the Redmi Note 7 Pro first of all what you have to do is you have to unlock the bootloader of your phone and in case if you don't know how to unlock the bootloader of your phone then I have made a separate video on it you can check the video will be in the description below so that you can easily unlock the bootloader of your any Xiaomi devices so then after what you have to do is you have to install custom recovery TWRP on your phone and in case if you don't know how to install custom recovery TWRP on your phone then I have made a separate video for it also so you can check the video will be in the description below so that you can easily install custom recovery TWRP on your Redmi Note 7 Pro so first of all I will make sure that my phone is not rooted and I'm going to use this root checker application and I will click on this check button and you can see my phone is not rooted so now I'm going to show you how to root this Redmi Note 7 Pro so for this you have to simply download these two zip files from the description below I'll provide the link in the description below so that you can easily download these two files and now you have to power off your phone and then after you have to go to the custom recovery TWRP mode and to go to the TWRP mode what you have to do is you have to simply hold the power button and the volume up button simultaneously for about 5 seconds then you will be redirect to the custom recovery TWRP mode and this is how custom recovery TWRP looks like so first of all click on this install button and then select the magisk zip file that you have downloaded from the description below and then swipe and then you will get an error 1 problem so you can see here this is the error 1 problem and you don't need to worry about it cause I'm going to show you how to bypass this error 1 problem as well so for this simply go back and click on this mount button and from here select fender and go back again and click on the install button and from here select the magisk zip file that you have downloaded and then swipe and then you won't get any kind of error as you can see magisk file is properly installing without any error and this will take some little bit of time so we have to wait and this is done so go back and click on the mount button again and from here select the fender again and then go back and click on the install button and from here select the disable the variety zip file and then swipe and this will also take some little bit of time so we have to wait here and now this is done so now click on reboot system and do not install and your phone will reboot to system and this will also take some little bit of time so I will skip this process so finally we are in lock screen mode and now I will directly open the root checker application to check either phone is rooted or not and you can see it requires a grant permission and you can see finally the phone is rooted so finally we have rooted our Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro and Magisk Manager application will be automatically installed on your device so just open that application and check either update is available or not and you can see there are two updates available so first of all I will update this first one so just click on this update button and then click on the install and now I will swipe down the notification panel and you can see it's downloading here and it's downloaded just click on it and install that updated magisk manager application and now it's installed so just open it and now there is another magisk update available so click on that update button and click on the install button and then click on the last one direct install recommended so just click on it and it will flash here and this will take some little bit of time so we have to wait here so I will fast forward this process and this is completed so now just click on this reboot button and then your phone will reboot to system and rebooting process has been completed now I will open the magisk manager application and you can see there is no any update available and there is written there magisk is up to date magisk manager is up to date that means we are in the latest version 
and in this way you can root your Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro and I hope you understand how to root your Xiaomi Redmi Note 7 Pro and I hope you like this video as well so if you like this video guys just let me know hit that like button comment below if you have any kinds of queries suggestions or any kinds of problem and share this video as much as you can and don't forget to subscribe to our crack Story YouTube channel and hit that notification bell as well so thank you for watching see you in my next video until then goodbye